what's the message to your team in the, in the wake of that when you know very little went right for you tonight? Not real happy. You know, I mean, we just we left our game in West Lafayette. You know, and it's just unacceptable the way we played tonight. You know, I apologize to our fans. You know, I'm the coach. I got to get them ready to play. And that was a bullshit performance tonight. Jack, I guess from an adjustment perspective, just what wasn't taking, whether it was in timeouts. You saw the same. Time. You saw the same game I did. They had their way doing everything they wanted to do. Jeff? In a game like that where the other team's making that many threes, is it more about trying to defend them and stop them, or is it more about, hey, we got to make threes too? How do you approach that aspect of it? How about playing some defense? That'll help, which was non existence tonight. Alex? Were you happy with the preparation coming in? Or was there anything you saw coming in that maybe? You no, I thought we prepared. You know, I mean, they just competed, man. They they came in here, and kicked our ass. It was just that simple. Why why were they able to get so free to get these three point shots off and to continue to stay in that rhythm? Why weren't you guys? Guys, we haven't given up forty seven points all year and a half. So I mean, nothing we did defensively that we worked on worked. We just. We weren't there for some reason, and I got to figure it out. Mike. Coach, how much time will you spend looking at this game? Are you just going to flush it and move on to the No, you got to look at it. I, ne I never let a game go on unnoticed. You got to look at it and learn from it. You know, but got to go back to work. We have tomorrow off, and Thursday we'll get back to work. Okay, Zion. Mike, you guys are own four against Iowa in the last two years. You've given up 80 plus in all of those games. What do the Hawkeyes do offensively that has given you issues? You saw the same game I did tonight. Okay. Thanks, Coach.